Welcome everyone. This interesting question given to us is a quadrant and a circle. The radius of quadrant is given as 7 cm and the length of this green line segment that's given as 1 cm. Exciting part is with this limited data we have to find radius of circle. Let's check this simple and elegant solution. Let's start by assuming the radius of blue circle as r cm. Let's assume this BO length as A centimeter and we know that when two circles are touching each other that is this blue and brown circle they are touching at point D then this point of contact and their centers that is P and O all lie in a straight line. Now here DP that is the radius of blue circle or R centimeter DO is the radius of brown quadrant that is 7 centimeter and thus PO length that will be 7 minus R. Now in triangle PBO applying Pythagoras theorem we'll get R square plus A square is 7 minus R square. To solve this equation we need one more equation in terms of variable R and A. For same let's do some more construction. First let's remove this construction. For our second equation let's join PC. PC is the radius of blue circle thus R centimeter. From point C let's drop a perpendicular on PB. Now here in this triangle PEC EC length that will be same as A centimeter. EB length that will be same as 1 centimeter and thus PE length will be R minus 1. Now in triangle PEC applying Pythagoras theorem will get r minus 1 square plus a square is r square. Subtracting these two equations here when we are subtracting a square will get cancelled down. LHS that will be r square minus r minus 1 square and RHS will be 7 minus r square minus r square. Both the sides let's open the bracket applying a minus b whole square identity. So we'll get this equation both the side will see that r square is getting cancelled down. Simplifying it we will get 16 r as 50. So r that will be 50 upon 16 or 25 by 8 and in terms of decimal r will be 3.125 cm and that's our answer. I hope you enjoyed the solution. I will see you in next video. Till then tata bye bye.